praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You're welcome in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 You're welcome on experiencing victory in God's way tonight. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Something better than Amen. else is a global family which we all know. And from this moment on, we go live. Amen. So it's Amen. our honor to welcome sweet Holy Spirit. Similarly, every one of you on this platform of pray your way up. We need to pray our way up tonight. Praise the Lord. We, we are going to declare and confess that just Christ cares for every one of us. Brethren, as you are where you are in your location, at your destination, I want you to begin to appreciate God. Let's worship God. Let's worship our maker. I want to hear you speak. I want God to hear you speak tonight. Let's worship the Lord. We exalt your holy name. The second half, the first half, the beginning and the end. Be that we exalted. Be that we exalted. Be that we exalted. Father, we lift you. Father, we exalt you. Father, we exalt you. We welcome your presence. We bow before your throne. We declare your majesty in heaven and earth. We thank you, God, because God, you are everything. In you we live, we move, we find our way. We shape you. We are not afraid to be We are not trapped. And Bible says it is written. Are content with him? Who content with you? And I will set your children. What a promise. Oh, God, you want to thank you. The account of Isaiah 49, 24, 3. The world says we are not trapped. The so world shall be pray be taken from the night day. Or the capsule of the to be we contend with those that contend with us and are going to save our children. Brethren, tonight, the fruit of our prayer is the result of prayer. I want somebody to just say hallelujah to that. The fruit of prayer is the result of prayer. So let's begin to worship our maker. Let's refrain the people of glory. Let's refrain the young that I am. Let's refrain the cause of Sharon. Let's refrain the one that brought us all again to God and also bless us. So that we can be able to experience victory in God's way. Let's appreciate God for what he did last month with thank you. For every spirit of Kadesh Banner. Brethren, we can't over thank God tonight for the year we pray for our goings, for our comings. Let's appreciate the one that can never lose a war, not to talk of losing a battle. Against her. The Bible says it's written in that Isaiah 
is sent true to a level. He said, send to the righteous, that it shall be well with them. Say to some better royals to lie. It shall be well with all of us. In the name of Jesus Christ. Everyone that I got it, even those that will sing Gada, the Lord says, I should say to you, we should say to you from this destination, that it shall be well with you. It shall be well with us. In the name of Jesus Christ, that we shall eat even the food of our doings. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go to the wicked, and in the name of Jesus, that is the word of God, and it shall be ill with him, in the name of Jesus Christ, 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 it shall be ill with the enemy, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, he shall be healed with, with the enemies, for the reward of his hands shall be given him. In the name of Jesus Christ, I don't want to appreciate you. I want us to begin to pray that every trap of sin that is sent for every one of us tonight will be broken as we pray. In the name of Jesus, I thought you are praying and I hope you are praying. Let's pray that every trap of sin set for those of us, that it will be broken tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ. In that every sin visible to any one of us tonight, he shall be broken. In the name of Jesus, that he proved that you are God. In the name of Jesus, prove that you are God in our midst tonight. In the name of every sin, every possessing sin, every load of things that is making us so good to be heavy. Even in spiritual realm, that they will bring them tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, come show for every one of us. Holy Spirit, come to Holy Spirit, come show for every one of us in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, come upon us afresh. Come upon us anew in the name of Jesus. We plead for the spirit of supplication and the spirit of prayer in the name of Jesus Christ. Let the shout of victory. Be oh God, my Father, in our camp in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, we will be able to our camp. In the name of Jesus, we will be able to destroy every enemy. Let us all one of our victories to be pronounced. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. I want us to begin to cover some of our blood, Jesus. I want us to cover the blood of our spiritual weapons. The blood of Jesus, right? We want to cover the everyone find themselves in the name of Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Amen. Brethren, navigating on top of Kadesh Bania must go. Is also experiencing victory in God's way. Amen. Amen. My friend, to name tonight, our lane is still the same because we believe in the power of prayer. Hallelujah. There's, there's an old way of saying things, and yes. which is, you are what you eat. And same is true for everyone tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. There's Amen. no substitute for victory, brethren. Everyone on the platform, there is no substitute for, for victory. There is nothing, brethren, as exciting as winning, winning battles. We know we can't fight these battles by ourselves. It's God that will fight our battles. Remember what we did last week. You remember what we did last month, rather? You remember what we did last month regarding, you know, destroying the spirit or the syndrome of Kadesh Banea. And we are asking God, that what do you have us to do in this month? And it says, navigating on top of Kadesh Banea must go, is expressing victory in God's way. And where do you express, want to express victory? It's not in God's name, in God's name. The Bible says the name of Jesus Christ is a strong tower. The righteous run into it, and they're what? And they are saved. Amen. So brethren, it is exciting. To win and we will win as we pray tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. So, victory in God's way is essential to our health, victory in God's way is essential to our career, 
Victory in God's way is essential even to our relationships. Victory in God's way is essential to everything we do, even about our parenting. Praise the Lord. And to be honest with you tonight, brethren, defeat is not our portion. And every spirit more than the name of Christ. And when defeat is is pronouncing the Lord Almighty is saying no more defeat. Instead, there will be what? There will be victory. And this is not God's will for our life. People to express defeat. It's not. It's not the, the the will of God. It's not the will of God for any one of us to express shame. It's not the will of God for any one of us to walk in defeat. To walk in, 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 in you know in, in breaking our heads down. No. And that's exactly what we are saying tonight. That it is not God's will for you and I, for our lives, for our relationship, for our marriages, to work in defeats or limitations. But it is the will of God for you and for myself to rise up in the middle of Kadesh Baniel spirit upon our lives and live in what? And live in victory. If you believe you are going to live in victory, if you believe you are going to experience victory tonight in God's way, I want to shout a resounding victory. Hallelujah. Brethren, Kadesh Baniel will be a walkover tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. And expressing victory in God's way, I want us to quickly look at 1 Corinthians 15, verse 57. We're going to do this ministration tonight in a different way as the Holy Spirit has inspired, not as a routine. Praise God. Expressing victory in God's way. 1 Corinthians 15, verse 57. It says, but thanks be to God who gives us victory as conquerors through our Lord Jesus Christ. Brethren, to walk over Kadesh Banya, because you remember what we did last month is to walk in victory, amen. To walk over, for God to make us to walk over Kadesh Banya is to walk in victory. You and I, we will walk in victory tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. And one thing I want you to understand tonight, brethren, is that think of a promise in your life from God that has not yet materialized. What are, what are those promises? Or think of just one promise in your life, in my life, from God that has not yet materialized. But hear me well tonight. Regardless of any obstacle, brethren, regardless of any walls that loom around, you know, around any single tonight, or loom around any one of us tonight, I'm telling you, because you are under the sound of my voice tonight, when you want to occupy or where you want to occupy, I'm telling you by the power of God tonight, you shall occupy them in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. When you want to occupy or fulfill God's purpose, brethren, there could be difficulties of age. There could be difficulties of health. There could be difficulties of relationship. There could be one of resistance. There could be one of impossibility. And you can hardly think of even thrill of victory without thinking of flashes of Kadesh Banner. But tonight, everything that is called Kadesh Banner in our lives, they will crumble in the name of Jesus Christ. The Bible says a name has been given unto me above every other name. At the mention of Jesus' name, the Bible says every name must bow. Every tongue confess that just Christ is what? Just Christ is the Lord. Amen. So they must crumble in the name that's above every other name. Brethren, I want to leave, with, leave you with this. The Israelites had bombs in their lives. Have you got bombs in your life? They had difficulties of labor. As we said last month, they wept, they mourned, but rather for them to remain mourning, Joshua and Caleb caught the vision. Joshua and Caleb, from experiences, never allowed themselves to focus on the problem of relationship. They never allowed themselves to focus on the problem of marriage. They never allowed themselves to focus on the, uh, on the problem of even, you know, taking the land. But they only said to God, we can do it. We can do it. No matter how the giants we are saying, we can possess the land. Brethren, have you promised God tonight that coming on this platform, your life will be meaningful? If you have promised God tonight, I want you to just tell God that, Father, I am here on 
this platform of sovereign battle royals. Let me explain victory in one second or in two seconds. I want you to just say it. I want you to say it to God's hearing. He said before you have not mentioned it, but now you need to mention it. The Father, I want to express victory in your own way, not in any man's way, because man's victory, they are limited. Brethren, but God's victory, it is ever living and it is forever. What the Lord has done, it shall be forever. Hallelujah. Brethren, we move. Both Joshua and Caleb, they never substitute anything for victory. When they made up their minds, they knew that victory refines, they knew that victory refires, and there's no substitute for victory. So remember real tonight. There is no substitute for what? For victories. And that would take me quickly to Exodus 8.28. Exodus 8.28, you can pen it down and study it later. Exodus 8.28, and it says, And Pharaoh said, I will let you go, that you may sacrifice to the Lord your God in the wilderness. Only you shall not go very far away. Entreat for me. Can you just imagine? Is that not Kedesh Barnier? Tell it, imagine Pharaoh telling the children of Israel, I will let you go, I will allow you to go, that you may sacrifice to the Lord your God in the wilderness. Imagine, wilderness. Only you shall not go very far away. So that is to say, he would say want them to lay back. He said want them not to possess their possessions. He said want them to be limited. He said want walls even to surround their lives. So that they can live in circles. But tonight, <laughs> brethren, tonight the Lord has told us that everyone that's connected and that will still connect, that will still play back, we shall all expect victory in God's way in the name of Jesus Christ. If you believe that, I want to shout hallelujah. I believe. Brethren, see what Pharaoh now did. He now agreed to let the people of God, the Israelites, to live. But however, he gave them a strange condition. And what was that strange condition? Only you shall not go very far away. Hey, hey. He said the implication of this statement was that enemy won't say you should not get married, but they can delay in parenting. Enemy, you know, may not say you should not, you know, go to school. But when it comes to good work, one may not really get it. Imagine poor self-image. You know, poor self-esteem that is so low can manifest at this particular point and it can continue to lead to unnecessary struggling. Ha, may somebody hear me tonight. Enough of struggles in our life in the name of Jesus Christ. I've said it earlier. But these people, that is the enemy, can just say, work. But you will not know how you spend that money. I pray tonight, that will not be our portion in the name of Jesus. And that will no longer be our portion in the name of Jesus Christ. So that shows that this Banyan spirit are known for intelligence. Brethren, they are highly skilled. No doubt about that. They are incredibly powerful, no doubt about that. And usually invisible warriors, but hear me well, they can hear us talk tonight. They can pass even through the walls tonight. They can fly through the space tonight. They can even in admit humans. They can alter human behaviors, power behind wrong positioning, manipulations. What corrupt voices are you listening to tonight? This word is for somebody. What corrupt voices are you listening to? Because you want to fail, and you are in the wrong place. I pray tonight, the Lord will change the story in the name of Jesus Christ. And you know the assurance tonight is that the sweets and the sweat of every of our labor <laughs> Every of our labor shall cry vengeance against those 
who have benefited from us and are still digging our pit. I want you to hear this. You know, sometimes some people are benefiting from you and still they don't want you to move forward. Do you find yourself in that situation? You know the assurance tonight is that the sweat of your labor, every labor, the sweat of my labor shall cry vengeance against those who have benefited from us and are still digging our pits, and so shall it be tonight in the name of Jesus Christ, experiencing victory in God's way. Remember, there's no for less power tonight. They will do what? They will bow. Brethren, I want us to pause and pray. Let us spend our time. Let us pause and pray. I pray that the Lord Almighty will connect you, will connect me with our benefactors in the name of Jesus. I want us to pray tonight. You know, hear this. Colossians 2.14. It says, Colossians 2.14. It says, blotting out the handwriting of ordinance that was against us, which was contrary to us. He took them out of the way and nailed them to the cross. Hear what Amplified Meaning says. It says, having canceled the certificate of debts, consisting of legal demands which were enforced against you, against me, and which were outside to us. And this certificate, he has set aside and completely removed by nailing them to the cross. Ah, I want you to pray where you are. Anyone or any location speaking nonsense to your life that you will not get married, you are single on the platform or you are married on the platform, any location you find yourself, any location I find myself, anyone speaking nonsense to our destinies, let their nonsense swallow them up. Prayer in the name of Jesus Christ. I want to know that you are praying and I want to believe you are praying. I want to believe you are praying, brethren. Anyone or any location speaking nonsense to our destiny. Every location or anyone speaking nonsense to my destiny. Let that nonsense, hey, swallow them up. Pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Ah, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. Anyone, oh God, my Lord, my King, hey, speaking nonsense. Anyone, oh, say nonsense to my life. Let their nonsense swallow them up in the name of Jesus Christ. Because you will see, oh God, in that Colossians 4, 2, 14, you will see blotting out the handwriting of ordinances that was against us, which was contrary to us. Every nonsense are contrary to our destiny. You say you took them out of the way and you nailed them to the cross. That anyone and any location speaking nonsense to our destiny, that did to neither. We say let the nonsense go back to them. Every single on this platform, anyone speaking nonsense to their relationship, ah, any location speaking nonsense to the relationship of any of the singles that's not align them, oh God, to see their life partner. Let the nonsense of such, oh God, go back to them. Is it from their father's house? Is it from their mother's house? Is it where, oh God, they are living? Is it where they are working? Is it among friends, among families? We don't see it really, really matter. That is my father, regardless of who they are. Anyone speaking nonsense in the life of these singles, oh God, that in our stead, my father, that says they will not marry on their own own timely fashion as you have ordained it, oh God. Let the nonsense of those people, oh God, swallow them up. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. We are praying. Every enemy of my life, every enemy of your life, the Lord replied them with results. You know, when God wants to reply your enemies, my enemies will result. Enemy that does not want you to settle down. You know what will God do? He will just slap them with results. You will just slap those enemies with results. I want you to turn into prayer. Every enemy of my life, every enemy of your life, every enemy of everyone on this platform. Ha <laughs> ha! Lord, slap those enemies with results in the name of Jesus. Because when the Lord makes your enemy a toothless bulldog, or the ones he needs to kill, he kills. The ones he needs to punish, he punishes. The one he needs to judge, he judges. Ah, what will happen? He will just slap them with that result. That 
that negativity results, uh, that results that, that, that they will not recover from. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, my Lord, behold, oh God, the threat of the enemy over these singles, oh God, that since they will not, oh God, set to down, that they in timely fashion, every enemy of their lives, oh God, the Lord replied them will resolve tonight. In the name of Jesus, you give us this word, oh God, that expensive victory in God's way. Every enemy of the singles, every enemy of the brothers, every enemy of the sisters on this plateau, my, pass of my father, that, oh God, the enemy of vowed that over their dead body would they settle down or they want them to just be going from one relationship to the other without anything concretized. That they slap those enemies with results, negative results in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are afraid, amen. In fact, when I caught this revelation of the Lord slap my enemies with results, I say, God, it has to be a negative result. Indeed. <laughs> I want us to pray. Father, I want you to uproot every form of delays, every form of obstacles standing on my way. Ha! Singles, you're about to open your mouth tonight. Ha! In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, uproot every form of delays. Ha! The list must be uprooted. The Bible makes me to know every tree in heaven my father has not planted shall be what? Shall be rooted up. <laughs> Master Prococo. Father tonight. Father tonight. Every form of delays in life of all these singles, oh God. Behold the threats of the enemy, my father. In the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, look at the sacrifice. Look at their labor. That even concerning prayers, oh God. Every Everyone, oh God, that in where, oh God, they hail from, uh, that says, oh God, they want to put delay as a stumbling block for them. My Lord, today, begin to approve. We will put them in agreement. We will put them. We will put them. We will put them. We will put them. You have done it before for us. That be my Father. You have done it before. You can still do it. As long as they are still remaining. Oh Lord, my King, Father, every form of delays in the lives of this single, be brother, be sister, even be single parent, we don't, we do ah, daddy, my father, we ask of your God, remove every delay, remove every obstacle, in the name, who tells you that you can't have a new life, even as a single parent, <laughs> who tells you that you can't have a new life, you can have a new beginning, God will give you a new beginning, he will remove those obstacles, those stigmas, he will remove from your body, those bit of rejection, he will destroy them tonight, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed, amen, I'm watching my time, I want us to also pray tonight, because we, we, you know what we say, we need to pray on this platform, we need to pray, I want us to pray, that Lord, I will not end halfway, I will not end halfway. You know, there are some singles when they have tried and tried and tried, you know, uh, you know, faith, their faith, you know, diminishes. But I don't want your faith to diminish tonight because he has promised that he's going to give you victory in his own way. Victory in God's way. And when God gives you victory in his way, you will express it and nothing will stand against it. Ah, in the name of Jesus Christ. And I want you to pray. Ah, because we can't stay together and you will not get settled. You must get settled by fire, by force. I say you don't desire it. But if you desire to set you down, brethren, ah, you will get settled. I want you to pray and tell God, I will not end halfway. I will not end halfway. I want you to tell God, you are married on this platform. I want you to tell God, I will not end halfway. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. That none of us will end halfway. In the name of Jesus Christ. The world says, oh God, my father. Death is swallowed up in victory. That is your word, my maker. You said, oh, death, where is your victory? Oh, grave, where is your sting? Sting of death in sin. No matter the sin in the life of these singles, oh God, that you will remove them tonight by your blood. There will be a cleansing, fresh cleansing. In the name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Amen. Hallelujah. Ecclesiastes chapter 5, verse 8. I want us to quickly read it. The book of Ecclesiastes chapter 5, verse 8. And I read from here. And it says, For he that is higher than the highest regardeth 
and there be higher than they. Hey, hey, probably you didn't hear it well. The book of Exodus chapter 5, verse 8, it says, For he that is higher than the highest regard it, and there be higher than they. <laughs> I want you to pray that from tonight I decree <laughs> and I declare I will not become a victim of blind trust. You know some people, they trust people. It's good to trust to some extent. But Bible says, woe unto that man that put hope <laughs> or put the trust solely on man. So I want you to pray everything that is called blind trust. Because when you trust man, <laughs> when man fails, <laughs> you become a victim. And I don't want you to, you to become a victim of evil circumstances. I want you to pray tonight. I decree and I declare. I will not become a victim of blind trust. <laughs> Prayer in the name of Jesus Christ. You are single on this platform. I want you to pray. You are single on this platform. I want you to pray. The Father, I will not become suddenly a victim of blind trust. Ah, in the name of Jesus. People might have, people might have disappointed you in the past. People might have wounded you in the past. It doesn't really matter. But at the same time, put your trust in God and God the Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. But to some extent, you can still believe in man. But I don't want you to become a victim of blind trust. In the name of Jesus. And that's where wisdom comes in. The Bible says wisdom is a principal thing. Hey, you know you're getting, get understanding. I want you to pray. I declare and I decree tonight, I will not become a victim of blind trust in the name of Jesus Christ. So people are just, you know, they just have a relationship or maybe love at first sight. And before you know it, it's just infatuation. Before you know it, disappointment. They put everything in it and the disappointment and they begin to like, oh my God, I'm regretting this. I want you to begin to ask God, I will not become a victim of blind trust. Pray in the name of Jesus Christ. I will not become a prey of the of the wicked ones in the name of Jesus Christ. Sisters, you will not become a prey of the wicked man or wicked men in the name of Jesus. Brothers, on this platform, you will not become a prey of wickedness of women in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Amen. We are on the session. Good. We have managed our time very well tonight. Hallelujah. We want to thank God for this climate weather. We want to really appreciate God. And I want to leave you with one thing tonight. Before I call on Sister Nikkei to just give us, um, um, as she's led in the praise worship. Amen. I want you to listen. You know, every prayer we pray, let us always align with scriptures. And that's what we need to pray scriptures. Amen. By the grace of God, I am a child of God. Hallelujah. And I want to believe you are too a child of God. So one thing I want to leave with you, when I was preparing for this ministration, something came and dropped, you know, in my heart. And I'm going to share it. You are a child of God by the grace of God. I am a child of God. But if anyone says anything that, that negates your future, brethren, what can be cancelled? If that is the only thing you are going to take home today, or take away from this platform. I want you to put it on your left hand and don't use it to eat. And by the time God lays something on our heart or in our mind, that shows he wants us to share it. So you are a child of God, I am a child of God. But if anyone says anything that negates your future, that negates your destiny, that negates your settlement, that negates your moving forward, you better cancel it because words can be canceled. Brethren, I don't know whether you are happy for what I said tonight. Happy or not happy, that's exactly what I'm led to say. And that's exactly what I am inspired to say it. So words can be canceled. If you can perceive that anyone says anything negative to your destiny, to negate your future, please, you have every boldness. You have every right as a child of God, by the grace of God upon you, and thinking connect with us, you have every grace to cancel that word in the name of Jesus Christ. And finally, I want you to just pray one prayer and I call Sanike to come up. I will not enter or go same way in the name of Jesus Christ. There must be testimony. Ah, Father, I will not enter the new month of August. Ah, imagine today's 21st. I was just looking at it. I said 21st, just like that. Ah, 21st, just like that. You better say it, that Father, as I enter into the month of August, ah, I will not enter the month of August the same way. Singles, ah, you better open your eyes like Adam. 
Open your eyes and see. God will open your eyes to see your Adam. In the name of Jesus Christ, you are sisters on the platform. God will open your eyes to see your Adam. You are, you are, you, you, you know, you are a man on the platform, a brother on the platform. God will open your eyes to see your Eva because there are many counterfeit relationships that are flying round about. I want you to just tell God, I will not enter the month of August the same way. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus, that is thank you. I want us to begin to appreciate God for this session. Let's appreciate God because God is faithful. Let's give him all the glory. Let's give him all the honor that you and I will not enter the month of August, Kabada, but the same way we entered in July. In the name of Jesus Christ, and anything that negates our lives, we cancel it, we push it tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, we will not end halfway. In the name of Jesus Christ, everyone on this platform who express their testimonies and they will come back to share it to your glory and to your praise. Thank you, our Father, for every obstacle, every form of every form of ungodliness have been removed. In Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed with thanksgiving. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So the next um, the next session now is pressing up. We just finished praying up. So we are going to press up now. Hallelujah. So it's my honor to welcome our esteemed sister. <laughs> we knew back from Africa. And thank God we can still think connect in Nigeria and in, in, in UK again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So welcome with me, my lovely sister Stanley K. I want us to just applaud the Holy Spirit in our praise the Lord. Can you unmute yourself? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 You're welcome, sis. Thank you, ma. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, everybody. Hallelujah. You can just give us five minutes to go. Yeah, then we're fine. Yeah. Thank All you. All right. Praise, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Yeah, in the attitude of worship, let's begin to appreciate God for a time like this. Glory. Let's Lord. thank him for the gift of life. Mm. The Bible says, it's not of him that runneth, nor of him that willeth, but it's mm. of God that showeth mercy. Yes. yes. Let's appreciate God for counting each and every one of us worthy to be among the living tonight. Thank you, Jesus. Because the Bible says, it's not by strength Glory. shall any man boast. Ooh. Let's thank God because many started this year together with us. They are no more. Mm -hmm. It's not because we are better than them. No. Neither is that because we are righteous than them. But the Bible says it's by his mercies that we are still alive today. Because his mercies endure it forever. Let's thank God. Let's appreciate him because he's a wonderful God. Yes, Father, we thank you. We appreciate you. Hallelujah. We give you all the thanks for a time like this. Hallelujah. Amen. Lord, we say may your name alone be exalted. Amen. As we worship you, Jesus, reign in our means in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we thank you because we know this you have done. We thank you because we know you've answered our prayers. For in Jesus' name, we have given thanks. Amen. 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 In the attitude of worship, let's appreciate God. Oh, be lifted. Above all other gods, we lay our crowns and worship you. Oh, glorious God, we honor you. We lay our crowns and worship you. Father, we thank you. We bless you. We lay our crown at this point in time to worship you because you're the King of Kings. You're the Lord of Lords. And Tana Rock of Ages, we say, may your name alone and alone be exalted in our means forever in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Lord, because we know you have done this in Jesus' name. We have prayed. Amen. 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 You are worthy of our praise. Oh, you are worthy of 
of our praise. Amazing. You are worthy of our praise. Oh, you are worthy of our praise. We give you all the glory. We give you honor. We give you all the glory. We give you honor, honor. We give you all the glory. We give you honor. We give you all the glory. We give you honor, receive all the glory, receive honor, receive all the glory, receive honor unto the Lord, be thy glory. Great things he has done unto the Lord. Be the glory. Great things he has done unto Jesus. Be the glory. Great things he has done unto the Lord. Be the glory. Great things he has done. Baba, 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 Baba. Eshe, oh, Baba. Eshe, oh, Baba. Awa, Baba, Baba. Baba, 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 oh, Baba. Eshe, oh, Baba. Eshe, oh, Baba. Awa, Baba. Enyini, Oluwa. Jehovah, enyini, Oluwa. You are the most I God, Jehovah. You are the most I God, God. In Jesus' name, we have worshipped. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. What a marvelous God, what a marvelous God, he has done marvelous things for us. What a marvelous God, what a marvelous, he's still doing marvelous things for us. What a marvelous God, what a marvelous God, he has done marvelous things for me. What a powerful God, what a marvelous, he's still doing marvelous things for me, hallelujah. What a marvelous God, what a marvelous God, he has done marvelous things for me. What a powerful God, what a marvelous, he's still doing marvelous things for me. Father to you we are the glory, we are the honor, we are the power and adorations forevermore. Father, to you, be all the glory, be all the honor, be all the power. And adorations forevermore. Father, to you, be all the glory, Jesus. Be all the honor. 
Testimonies in Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name, we have praise. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Amen. You know that you know that you enjoyed that session. It was so short but very powerful. I want you to just raise your hands and wave to your maker that Stanley can come back later. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory, 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 glory be to the Lord Almighty. God bless you, my sister. That is there, you know, back, you know, uh, I think 15 years there about or even more. More than that. More than that, exactly. Yeah. So that, that voice did not change. <laughs> glory, you will sing in everything. Amen. But thank God for your life that you are still Amen. strong, like I used to know you. Praise mm -hmm. the Lord. Hallelujah. So, well, um, after we finish that, you know, we always time conscious, we press for time. Uh, the next thing we are going to do now is just to pray for the birthday celebrants of July and those celebrating anniversary in the same July. And um, I have that uh, privilege and that humility to invite um, our dear mother, uh, actually, uh, Pastor Omelara. Uh, Awashika, <laughs> if I tell you the story, you know, she's one of our Zona mommies back in Nigeria, hallelujah, she's on holiday at the moment. But, you know, we think connect when we were in school together. So we didn't know ourselves, but one way or the other, our senior pastor, you know, Pastor Dewa Awashika in London here, we just, uh, you know, we just think connect with them. And by the time, you know, the senior, that is to say the senior brother came to, uh, to the church, and we now discover that we got talking, and it's just like, oh, we went to the same NC together in the early, in the 80s, hallelujah. So she's on holiday at the moment, but my spirit just led me this morning that no, we need, I told my husband that we need to just, you know, bring her up, let her come and, you know, uh, pray with this, uh, with the birthday celebrants of July, and those people celebrating anniversary, and my husband said, oh, I came to eat, that's fantastic. So I have that privilege and that humility and that honor to welcome Pastor Omelara Awashika. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. As you are doing your assignment, Hallelujah. as you are doing your assignment, and you are yes, still going yeah. to do the closing prayer for us. So you are going no to problem. for us as well. Holy Spirit will help us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's a privilege to be amongst you this evening. Oh. And I want to bless God for this opportunity. Oh. I won't take it for granted. Oh. And I will start with this song. My hallelujah oh. belongs to you. Glory. My hallelujah belongs to you. You deserve it. You deserve You deserve Wow, You deserve My hallelujah belongs to you. My hallelujah belongs to you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
I would like to celebrate everyone born in the month of July, including me. Oh, wow. <laughs> I congratulate everyone once again. According to Psalm 90 verse 12, the Bible says, teach us to number our days wow. that we might apply our acts to wisdom. Glory. It means only the wise can be grateful to God for sparing their lives. Mm and to experience another year, Glory. another birthday. Glory. We will not take this for granted. That is why we will pray. As I'm praying, please be praying along. I want you to open your mouth. I pray that God's plan and purpose concerning your life shall come to fulfillment. As many that are born in the month of July, Father, the purpose and the plans of life the life of God concerning their lives shall come to fulfillment. In this month of perfection, the good Lord will perfect all that concerns you in the name of Jesus. That concerns you and all those, those that are related to you, the good Lord shall perfect all that concerning them. Because the month number seven stands for perfection. And everything that concerns you to your business, your career, to your ministry shall be perfected in the name of Jesus. And the good Lord will shine his countenance upon you. His grace, his goodness, his glory shall encompass your lives in the name of Jesus. This new year shall usher you into divine favor, mercy, love, joy, and prosperity in the name of Jesus. In this new year, it shall be new levels, new heights, New opportunities in the name of Jesus. I pray that as you continue in this new year, it shall be divine health. You shall not wither. You shall not wither. You shall prosper in all ramifications, in all your endeavors. According to Psalm 1, verse 3, he said, You shall be like that tree planted by the rivers of water that brings forth its fruits around the season. It means there's some the scarcity in your life in this month of july because the lord shall decorate your life the lord shall bless you tremendously even beyond your own imaginations in the name of jesus as many that are in the divine yard of the lord doing one thing or the other the work of the lord shall not suffer in your end you shall not fail you shall not fall you shall not falter the first wisdom and knowledge of God shall be your portion. I pray that, that in this month of new beginning, this month of perfection, my God shall take you higher, stronger, and deeper in his words in the name of higher, stronger. It is well with your body, it is well with your soul, it is well with your spirit in the name of Jesus. I bless the glory of the Lord concerning your lives in the name of Jesus. In Isaiah 60 verse 1 said, Arise and shine, for your light has come, and the glory of the Lord has risen upon you. I said those born in the months of July, arise and shine. In this new year, arise and show forth the glory of the Lord in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we are prayed. We pray for those that are celebrating one thing or the other, having an anniversary. And I want the singles to key into this. Hmm. Don't pray as if you are a single. Pray as if you are a married woman or a married man. Ooh. Prayer in the name of Jesus. I say God will celebrate you in any way, in any form. As you are celebrating your wedding anniversary or any anniversary you are celebrating, or even is it your business or your career, God will celebrate you. And as many as are singles in the house, I want you to hold on to this. Psalm 128 verse 3 says, the wife shall be as fruitful Amen. as a vine Amen. by the sides of thy house and thy children like the olive plants that surround your table. Amen. In the name of Jesus, no matter what is your challenge, my God is overriding everything with grace in the name of Jesus. Amen. The glory of the Lord shall show forth for you, even in this month, in the name of Jesus. And in verse 6, he said, you shall see your children, children. It doesn't matter 
If you are not married yet, I am prophesying into your life that you shall be married and you shall be fruitful. And you shall not wither away in the name of Jesus. I say you are going to celebrate in the name of Jesus. Another promise in the book of Genesis. God said, Lord, the Lord said, there will be great and mighty testimonies in your life. Amen. So in anything, he said he shall give you the bone of your bones Amen. and the flesh Amen. of your flesh. Amen. Genesis 22, 23 said that, that you shall become a nation Amen. because he took from Adam Amen. from his ribs Amen. and he made Eve. Amen. So, so therefore, you shall not remain single. Amen. And those single mothers, the Lord shall visit you gloriously. Amen. It doesn't matter what people have said. I, I want you to forget all the tags that has been given to you. The fire of the Holy Ghost is burning them away. Amen. My sister said something in her prayers. I wrote it down. No more delays. Amen. In the name of Jesus. No more delays. Your life shall glorify God. Men shall see you and glorify the, his name in your life. In the name of Jesus. You are made in God's image. And the Lord shall say to you gloriously. In closing, I want us to just say, praise the name of the Lord. Let us give God all the glory. Appreciate you closing. Let's give him all the honor. Let's give him all adoration. Our wonderful God, we thank you for another wonderful session in your presence. Hallelujah to the King of Kings. Hallelujah to the Prince of Peace. Hallelujah to the Lord of hosts. Wonderful counsel of mighty God. Everlasting Father, our glorious God. We make our excellent thing. We bow before you. We worship at your feet. We bow before you. You are the glorious God. Indeed, you honor your words more than your name. Your promises concerning your children shall come to pass. I say when they are gathering again next month, it shall be testimony galore in the name of Jesus. I thank you for using your daughter and her family and others, many that you are using for this program. That they shall not be done. Amen. Your glory alone shall be upon their lives. Yeah. You will shine their, your countenance upon them yeah. and they shall serve you to the end. Yeah. I pray that all of us on that glorious day, yeah. all of us shall be missing. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Yeah. Thank you because you have heard. For in yeah. Jesus, mighty name, we are free. Yeah. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise, 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 the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In fact, you, that was too loaded. Hallelujah. It's <laughs> the only two in the thing. Oh, thank you so much, man. Hallelujah. People on the, you have just sent me to say thank you, mama, for coming. Ah, thank you, CC and CC. Thank you, mama. God bless you, ma. Thank you, ma. Thank God. Thank God. The Mama, Lord decorate our lives in Jesus' name. Yes, ma. <laughs> Thank you, ma. We will not fall in the name of Jesus. Amen. Ma. Amen. Amen. The family it shall be well with them. Amen. Good, 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 good news in numbers. In Amen. I Thank you. you and I love you by the precious pool of the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I love you all too. God bless Amen. you all. Thank Bye. you, ma. Shall we share the grace and fellowship, brethren? Thank friend? you, ma. The grace of the Lord, the Jesus, of the Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the love of God, and, and the grace of the Holy Spirit be with you now and forever. Amen. 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 All the days of my life, and I shall be the just forever and ever. Amen. I want you to do it to yourself. Goodness and mercy shall follow me. Goodness and mercy shall follow me. All the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the heart of the earth forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Shout hallelujah. 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 Bye. God bless you all.
Thank you, Ma. Thank you all. God bless you, Ma. God bless you, Ma. God bless you, Ma. God bless you, Ma. Bye. 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 God bless you, Ma.